What the fuck do you want, SpongeBob? Ah, oh, I drive you and I was just wondering if you had any ideas for Squidward's birthday present. Squidward? That miserable piece of shit. Why would I give a flying fuck about his birthday? Well, he's my friend, and I want to get him something nice. Fine. How about a new clarinet? Holy shitballs. Pride Jr., you're a goddamn genius. Yeah, yeah. Just don't forget who came up with the idea when Squidward starts sucking your dick in gratitude. Ah, why? Never mind, just come back anytime if you need more brilliant ideas from me. To be continued. What the hell is this? Happy birthday, Squidward! I got you a clarinet! A clarinet? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's so cool. Dr. your junior gave SpongeBob the idea. What so easy. Oh, you're Me with the cake too. Hey guys, did you hear about Perch Perkins? He's got some big news to share. That's right, folks. I'm finally getting my own talk show. Oh, please, like anyone wants to listen to your boring this for an hour. Excuse me, who asked for your opinions? Shut up, Squidward's birth. But he doesn't want to hear about your stupid show either. And now, let's go in Squidward's special day with all this are going. Shut up, Patrick. What is laws? Oh, can we have a dance party now? Sure thing, SpongeBob. Let's get this party started. This is going to be one hell of a talk show. Good evening, Bikini Bottom. This is Perch Perkins reporting live from the studio. Tonight's top story, Plankton, the owner of the Chum Bucket and notorious villain, has recently started a successful advice company, and joining us over the phone is... Greetings, Perch. I prefer to be called Dr. Junior. Thank you very much. <laughs> Dr. Junior, how did you manage to turn your life around and become a successful advisor? Well, it all started when I realized that my plans for world domination were not working out so well. So I decided to use my intelligence for something more productive. That's quite a change of heart for someone who has been trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula for years. So that's quite a change of heart. Oh please, that was just a phase in my life. Now I'm focused on helping others with their problems and giving them valuable advice. But some may argue that your methods are questionable considering your past actions. Interesting. Nonsense! My methods are foolproof and have been proven effective by numerous satisfied customers. But what about those who say you are just using this as another way to get your hands on the Krabby Patty formula? Oh, Parchy boy, you always know how to make me laugh. The Krabby Patty formula is old news now. My advice company is where all my focus lies now. The moving kind of advice do you offer exactly? Anything and everything from relationships to business strategies. There's nothing I can't help with. And for a small fee, of course. And how much success have you had so far? Let's just say my bank account is looking quite full these days. Well, that's certainly impressive. But some may still question your credibility considering your past as a villain. 
Well, that's certainly impressive. But some may still question your credibility considering your st as a villain. How dare you! I am a change man and my advice company is proof of that. Now if you excuse me, I have more important things to attend to than this ridiculous interview. <laughs> this is Perch Perkins signing off from the studio. Back to you in the newsroom, SpongeBob. Okay then, and to you in the in the studio, Sponge. <laughs> Did he just hang up on Perchy Boy? Looks like someone still got some injury issues to work. Well, at least we know we're not to go to for advice now. Listen up, you little shits! I've finally made it big and now I'm gonna start singing. Oh boy, Plankton's gonna sing. This is gonna be great. Yeah, let's hear a sample of your beautiful voice. Fine. Yeah, Krabby Patty, how I love thee. Bravo, that was amazing. What in the barnacles is going on here? Looks like Plankton's got some new fans. That's right, losers! And now that I'm famous, Mr. Krabs can't stop me from getting the secret formula! Ah, uh, what's the use? You win this time, Plankton! Aha! This was my plan all along! Well, if you're taking over the Krusty Krab, then count me in on your team! Excellent choice, Squidward! Together we're all Bikini Bottom! SpongeBob and Patrick look at each other with worried expressions as they realize their friends have turned against them. Oh, oh, hey, wait a minute. Did you guys just say we're not on your team? Of course not, you idiots. We're joining forces with Plankton to take over the world. But why would you do that? Don't you know he just wants to steal the formula for himself? Ye Squiddy, don't be such a traitor to our beloved restaurant. Traitor? Ha! More like genius mastermind! And besides, I'm sick of working at the Krusty Krab anyways. That's the spirit, Squidward. Now let's go plot our evil plans and leave these two losers behind. SpongeBob and Patrick watch in shock as their friends walk away with Plankton, leaving them alone at the Krusty Krab. Well, this is just great! We've lost our friends and now we're stuck here with no customers. Yeah, what a bunch of assholes! Let's go get some ice cream to cheer ourselves up! Good idea, Patrick! Screw those guys! We don't need them, but to walk out of the restaurant arm in arm, determined to make the best of their situation without their former friends by their side.
I can't believe it, SpongeBob. My talent for singing has been stolen. What? Who would do such a thing? I don't know. But I was about to take over the world with my amazing voice, and now it's gone. Oh no, what a tragedy. The world will surely crumble without Plankton singing. You need to wear domination when you can just sing for spare change on the street corner. This is serious. My whole plan is ruined because someone stole my talent. Well, maybe we can help you get it back. Remember all the good times we've had together. Like that time we went jellyfishing. Flashback to SpongeBob and Plankton happily jellyfishing together. Yeah, it was fun. Oh, please. Like that's going to solve anything. Whoa! And remember, when we all sang Krusty Krab visit together, flash back to SpongeBob, more crabs, Squidward and Plankton singing and dancing in the Krusty Krab kitchen. Say, we're great singers too. Hey, lad. We'll help you get your business back with our amazing voice. All right then, let's do this! I can't believe I'm about to say this, but count me in tow. Yes, they'll show them who the real singers are! Yeah, let's do it for Plankton's stolen talent! And for all the money we'll make from his singing career! And then, world domination will be mine once again! <laughs> <laughs>